Do not fast forward, sirs and madams. Important day. You will never get this chance again. <laughs> I'm Mike Geyser, and this is my uh, case study of my Legion secret. The reason why I did this is because I know everyone likes to skip ahead. But this is the last time that I can show you all of my data beginning to end. So this is going to be a video where I really analyze everything regarding my hops, regarding my seals, going over all that data for the last time, beginning to the end of the journey. Well, not the end, but you know, where we are today. So stay tuned for that, okay? Now, for everyone else, uh, public service announcement, uh, I've said this over and over again, most people must know by now, I'm running another series side-by-side -side parallel to this one. It's my high ticket series. And right now we're on day number six. I'm basically showing you how I generated, I kept this under wraps, I generated an additional $1,000 a month income stream, which is where it's at right now, in a matter of two months time, okay? And I'm showing you step by step what I did to generate that income stream through this mini series. So it's starting off at day zero and it's going all the way up to day seven. So there's one more day left, but if you wanna come on board and see what this is all about, don't start off over here. You're gonna be lost. You're not gonna be able to follow along because the things I'm telling you to do build upon the prior video. So you need to start over at day zero. So go back, start over at day zero and follow along with this journey if this is something that you're interested in. But for everyone else that's looking to learn more about My Legion Secret, let's now go into this. So before we get into the results um, for the day, let's go over what this is. This is a system that is designed to drip feed us 100 leads each day. And these leads are in the internet marketing space. They're looking to make money online in some form or fashion. So what we're doing with these leads that are building up, you know, it's building up to like 3,000 at the end of the month, then 6,000, then 9,000. And we are going over to clickbank.com, the affiliate marketplace, finding products over there that are related to making money in some way, and grabbing these email swipe files, the vendors of the products that we're promoting. They're giving us 10 free email swipe files to use to promote their product. We're copying those emails, pasting it inside of this system, My Legion Secret, it has a built-in mailer, and we're mailing out to these leads that are building up, and we're looking to get sales that way by sending out these emails. So this is a cheaper alternative than say, buying an email, uh, what is it called? <laughs> autoresponder. Buying an autoresponder for 30 to 40 bucks a month to start with anyways, and then buying solo ads over and over again. 50 bucks for 100 clicks, 50 bucks for another 100 clicks. In contrast, this is a dollar per day for 100 leads because of the $30 a month membership fee, okay? So one other thing is, it's a, it's a $30 setup fee the first month. So $30 setup fee the first month, $30 recurring billing the first month, so that's $60 the first month. Second month, it's just the recurring billing, and so on for each successive month. So it's a cheaper alternative than doing solo ads, and thus far, I'm in profit. I've been, I broke even day 50, so month two, I broke even, and by the end of, by day 60, end of month two, I was in profit, and I used to say, as long as things continue, I'm in profit 400 to $500 a month, but things are looking up. Things are looking like it's going to increase to maybe double that this month. We're going to wait and see. We're going to go over the results a little bit later. But there's been a sharp incline in the amount of money that I'm making, which is very encouraging and exciting. So one thing I want to mention is that if you refer someone to this service, you can get these bonus leads over here. You see? So if you use this referral link and you get someone to sign up to My Legion Secret, you will get 200 leads a day. And that means that you will get 6,000 leads at the end of the month and then 12,000 and so on, right? And that is a way to really up the income that you can create with this system. But that's not where it stops because if you don't have anyone to refer, you can refer yourself. And if you do that, you've got 200 leads coming in here, 100 here, that is 300 leads a day. And that is 9,000 leads at the end of the month. Right? And then it becomes 18,000, then 27,000. So it's getting more interesting. But again, that's not the end of it. Although 200 is the max per account, you can chain multiple accounts, one under the other. And that's what I've done. I've created seven accounts. Each one's got 200, except the bottom one, which has 100. But 
because I got some bonus signups on my bottom account, I now have 200 for all seven. That is 1,400 leads a day. So that is how I saw these crazy results. But you don't have to go and get seven accounts. I'd say a recommended is five accounts. If you want to see a decent amount of results in a reasonable time frame, go with five accounts. If you're strapped for cash, then you can go with two accounts. That way you're at least taking advantage of the bonus leads. But just keep in mind, you're going to have to exercise a little more patience for the leads to build up to that critical mass point where you start seeing the sales that you, you want to see, the income that you want to see. Okay, so typically the sales start popping week three, week four. That's what I've noticed on average. Some people get lucky and see a sale on day four. Some people have to wait 45, even 55 days. And I've seen that happen with someone with two accounts. So if you have fewer accounts, just keep that in mind. You might have to exercise more patience, okay? This game is gonna mess with your mind, but it is a numbers game. The longer you stick with it, the longer, the, the more leads build up, you're gonna get those quality leads coming in eventually, and then those seals are gonna start popping for you, okay? So anyways, that is it in a nutshell. I think I've covered everything, have I? I'm pretty sure I have. Okay, so what we wanted to go over is the results for the day. So let's see, let's see if I got a sale. And, boom, got a sale. $43.61, and the great thing about this is this puts us at $229.41 for the week. That's what I was looking to hit, at least 225 and over. You see, it's funny the way this works. Like you're at a point where you're seeing the, the number is not where you want it to be, and then there's only like two days left, and <clears throat> boom, back-to-back -back sales. We made like close to 100 bucks, right? We were 100 bucks shy of the 225 before. Now we've pretty much gotten that 100 bucks, and we're at over 225. So things can change in an instant in this game. Now, let's go look at uh, where this came from. And this is account number one gave us this, okay? So we got a $13.73 sale, $29.88 upsell. And let's look one last time. Oh, not yet. Let's look at the hops. Hops are 1,367. And uh, funny enough, these earnings per click, oh. I know this is only for one day, but the earnings per click over the last 14 days, I checked, it's, you know, it's higher than usual. I'll talk about that more later on. Anyways, we got, look at the, look at all these order form impressions, insane, 18, 18 order form impressions. Someone was clicking away at that <clears throat> order form. And uh, let's look at this. So this is the last, you know what, before I show you this, let me just go, go back over here. Let me show you this first. So this is where we're sitting at. Look at this. Over 1,000. Over 1,000 in one month. We've hit it. Now, that's not to say that we're over 1,000 in profit, though, because I do have to pay $210 each month as a fee for my seven accounts. So this is only $800 profit right now. I'm sitting at $800 profit. So I went from $400 to $500 profit to $800 profit at this moment, which is double pretty much because we still have two days left before the end of the month, right? We have 30th and 31st to get sales. Two more days. And we are on email number eight of Social Paid. So I'm gonna stick with this, I think, Social Paid to the very end. And we're gonna see if Social Paid will come through for us and get us up even higher. Because if we can, I mean, <laughs> I'm aiming for at this point 1,100 and change, right? And if we can get that, then we'd be at $900 profit for the month. And funny enough, we are we are on par with my original calculations, my original projections as far as where I see this headed. I made these original projections, I think way back over here, month one, I or month two, around here, the beginning of month two, end of month one. I thought to myself, look, I'm making 250 bucks a month. If each month I go up 250 bucks, then by this month over here, I'll be making 1,000. And uh, profit that is, right? And uh, this was profit. So I was thinking in terms of profit. So that is where I would be, you know, in another month's time. Like if we're at 1,000 right here um, and we get another 250 over here, we would be at over $1,000 profit. And if this were to continue, then by the time we hit July, August, we'll be at $2,000, which will be very interesting because my goal is to get to at least 2,000, 3,000 bucks a month. 2,000 is a nice place to be, but 
you know, three thousand dollars is, uh, you know, I have seen the person that I learned this from. I'll, I'll go and say this: uh, Michael Day is who I learned this from. He's done a case study where he made three thousand eight hundred dollars or four thousand dollars. The only thing is, he didn't do it back to back consecutively like I'm doing it here. He did it every other day, and he counted the days where he was uh, running it. So consecutively, we've never seen, uh, you know, what what happens with his accounts if he does it consecutively. So, anyways, getting off track here. This, I don't want the video to go on too long, but I, I'm just saying that getting to three thousand dollars a month is a nice marker. So I, I'd like to see this happen um, sooner rather than later. This will be the end of the year if it continues on in this rate, but we'll see. So. Anyways, let's look at the sale. This, this sale came from account number one. Account number one is now at its ninth sale. We have a bunch of accounts now getting their ninth sale. And this brings account number one to, let's see over, what, what was I doing there? To 387. Okay, so now the number one, the top accounts now are number two, number three, and maybe number seven. These are the top accounts. Uh, or maybe maybe we could consider this a top account now too because this is not too far off from seven um, And then these would be the bottom of the the barrel I guess But anyways, it's hard to say now things fluctuate all the time so much. So that's where we're at uh, One thing I want to show you now. This is the main thing I want to show you is going over the statistics Okay, so for everyone that I told in the very beginning to pay attention. This is what I wanted to show you This is the last time I can show you all this information so beginning to end, this is what I've noticed. When looking at this chart, the blue line is the seven day moving average. The green line is the, the hops for the day. So you can see that it's jagged, right? But the blue line averages it out. And you can see that the average, the blue line, goes up in a wave and then crashes. Goes up in a wave, crashes. Goes up in a wave, crashes. Up, crashes. Now we're gonna see what happens next, but this has been the pattern, a slow, upwards trajectory in terms of my hops and let's look over oh let's also look at these numbers over here might as well look at these numbers this is the last time we'll be able to do it 1,118,397 hops total okay earnings per click two cents average hops per order 1,940 and look at this social paid this used to be 2,600 hops per order since I've been using those special landers that avoids the quiz, the initial quiz. Normally when you send people to the social paid landing page, there's a quiz they have to go through and then they get to the job offer. So they go through the quiz and it says, here's your match, here's your job match. We've been bypassing the quiz, sending them straight to the job offer. And this has worked out. It, it, we have proof here. This has gone down from 2,600 to 2,300, which means if you are promoting social paid, you should be using that lander. If you wanna see a reduction in your hops per order. And this is huge. Me sharing this is a huge revelation. This data, this data is a huge revelation for everyone that is doing this pro this system and promoting social paid. So right apps is at 1,600, 1,700. Okay. Which is good. And we have, uh, let's see what else to look at over here. Um, what else? What else? Anyways, you could pause this and look at all the details you want to look at, but initial sales were at $1,105. Uh, we have 61 initial sales over here. We have 36 upsells. We have $1,473 as an upsell amount. Gross sales total is 2,578 and net sales is 2,578. The great thing about these programs is the refund rate is very, very low. It is less than 10%. It is 0% in my case, which is amazing. And that's one of the features that they mention on their affiliate page. They say, these are the reasons why you should promote our products. One is that we have a very low refund rate. So I know a lot of people have looked at this product and thought to themselves like, look, this doesn't look like it's a quality product. Like, you know, this looks kind of, you know, shady or whatever, like th this, this job offer that they're offering, but we don't know what the actual product is on the back end. But if only 10% of people are refunding, that says the entire story, right? Because that means that people are happy enough with it that they're not, they don't need to return it. So this apparently is a good product. Otherwise the statistics would show us otherwise, right? If we had a high refund rate, that would tell us the whole story that this is not a quality product. People are unhappy. People are returning this on mass. 
but if only 10% and less than 10% are returning it, this must be, these, both these products must be quality. Anyways, so this is the last time I can show you all this information, take it in, take a screenshot, or pause it, pause the video and look at these stats. Now, let's now move on to one last thing I want to show you. Well, I'll show you this as well, but first I want to show you something else. And it's the last 14 days. The last 14 days for social paid. Look at this, earnings per click, three cents. It is higher than write app reviews. I've always seen earnings per click at two cents all the time. Boom, this is at three cents and it's at 1,428 hops per order. This is a little bit lower than write apps. So this is very interesting statistics right over here. So I'm gonna just scroll through this. You can pause it and look through it if you want, but these are the details over the last 14 days. And this is encouraging me to focus on, even though we had a gap here, we did have a gap. When I was starting to promote social paid, we had this sale, this sale, this sale, and I was thinking, Okay, this was great, but then we had two baby sales, and then we had a, a blank, like a zero. And I was thinking over here, okay, two baby sales and a zero. Should I even, this, is this even a good product? Is this really gonna be working out for me? Because in the past, social paid has disappointed me, <laughs> to be honest with you. And it's, it's doing well, according to these statistics. It is doing well. And it's giving, the statistics are telling me that I should keep promoting this and see where this takes us. So that's what I'm going to do. And this is all that I wanted to share with you. So now you have all my statistics over here. And this is uh, the last time you can look at this chart. Okay, the beginning of my journey. I started off with five accounts, right? And then somewhere along here, let's see, day one, two, three, four, five, six. Day six, I got account six, I think. And then day seven, I got account seven, I believe. And then day 17, I got my first sale. Things have been consistent in terms of sales since then. And that's typically what happens. When you get your first sale, things start, a new paradigm forms, right? And a new paradigm forms uh, within a paradigm. As you can see, I've, I went from having gaps of three days, two days, to having gaps of only one day over here for 12 days, and over here again, one day gaps for 20 days, over here, right? And then we had another paradigm form of back-to-back -back sales, and then again, back-to-back -back sales, and now it looks like again back-to-back -back sales we'll see how long this one lasts but that is all that i wanted to go over with you so this is the last time all this information will be shown so for those of you who are looking to get on board with this if you're interested in trying this out for yourself uh let me see over here um come over down here to this description over here and click on this link and if you use this link do let me know in the youtube comments or send me an email at mike at gmail.com m-i-k-e-i-s-e-r consulting at gmail.com so that you can get free email support from me and you can get 500 free email swipe files now out of these 500 emails swipe files 200 of them are written in such a generic fashion that they can be copy and pasted to promote any offer that you want okay the other 300 will need some reworking but these 200 you could use them to copy and paste and promote warrior plus my legion secret itself or any other offer and the reason why you'd want to promote my legion secret is so that you can get those signups on your bottom account so if you've got five accounts at 900 leads a day because your bottom account only has 100 leads and you want to get that bonus sign up on your bottom account you can copy and paste these emails get that last sign up so you're getting an, ad an additional 3,000 leads a month okay so do let me know one way or the other if you did purchase through my link so i can send you over those resources but anyways, you're gonna click on this link, okay? This will lead you to this page over here. We're just gonna go over what this is all about. You can look it over if you'd like, but you need to click on this button over here, okay? And then enter your email and click get started. And when you do that, this is gonna lead you over to the sales page. So let's go back to the sales page. It's gonna look like this. So from here, once you decide to sign up with your account, you click this button, you sign up for your first account, and you're about to log in this is where you're gonna to have to pay attention because we need to set up the rest of the accounts properly. The first account doesn't matter, second account, it does matter. So let's now log in. Okay, let's not loading over here. Let me just try again. I'm gonna log into my first account. If it'll let me. Okay, there we go. Okay, so you log into your first account and then you're going to copy this link, this referral ID, paste it in your browser. 
and then sign up for your second account. That way your second account is made underneath your first account, giving your first account the 100 bonus leads. And you'll be able to check that that's worked by going to my leads over here and seeing that this shows us 200 leads. But it's gonna appear in 24 hours. So you're gonna have to wait for that to appear. So the first day you will have 100 leads, second day you will have 300 leads, and then 500, and then 700, you see? And one other thing is use a separate email for every account you create. You can create five accounts with Gmail with one phone number, and you can then use Yahoo, Mail.com, or ProtonMail if you run out of mails. And one other thing is that you want to add a number to your first and your last name if you're creating multiple accounts in the same day. And what I mean by that is Mike2, Iser2, Mike3, Iser3. The reason being is that the system sometimes rejects the same first and last name over and over again for multiple accounts. So that's just a way to work around that happening. And you can delete those numbers later on in the profile over here. Just remove those, okay? And also, when you're chaining your accounts, let me just draw this this time for fun. Uh, what you're gonna do is when you have account number one, you're gonna use the referral link from account number one to sign up account number two. And then to get account number three signed up, you're gonna use account number two's referral link to sign up account number three, right? The, re the referral link for account number two to get account number three signed up. And then for account number four, you're gonna use the referral link for account number three, okay? And sign up account four. You're gonna do it in this way so that you're chaining them so that each one gets the bonus leads, okay? And if you run into any issues, support knows that people wanna create these multiple accounts, they can sort you out and you can use the same credit card for all these accounts. So once you are done with setting that up, you're gonna to go to clickbank.com and if it doesn't log me out, uh, it's easy to sign up for ClickBank. I won't show you how to do that, but I am gonna show you how to set up a nickname inside of ClickBank because you have to do that. So once you've signed up with ClickBank, you open this up, you go to accounts over here, and hopefully it doesn't log me out. Go to create an account, and then you create an account nickname, uh, an affiliate account first. You have to select affiliate here, and then type in your nickname over here, but follow the, I knew it. I just knew it was gonna happen. <laughs> Anyways. I'm gonna have to go back over here. Uh, let me see. Okay, let's log back in. Okay, so you're gonna create an account nickname and once you've done that, following those instructions, this will pop up over here, okay? So you click on this, you open this up, and this will lead you to an overview page of all your results. Now from here, you're gonna open up the marketplace. And here you're gonna see all the different categories of products that you can promote. But we wanna focus on e-business and e-marketing. This is what's gonna get us the best conversions for these leads that are being generated for us. So click on this, and then out of all these products, we wanna sort this by gravity so that we got the products on the top of the list that are generating the most sales for the most affiliates ranked downwards from there. So we wanna focus on promoting these products at the top. Now, I like promoting write app reviews, and I like promoting this product right over here. Now this is what we're currently promoting. So let's now open up this affiliate page over here to get the resources. And by the way, when you buy MLGS, they will upsell you to get some email swipes, but you don't have to buy that because we're using the free email swipes provided to us over here, okay? Just so you know. So we're on email number eight. So let's open up email eight and let's drag this over here so it's easier to copy and paste the information over. So we just copy this, highlight it, press Control C, come over here, go to mailing system, select all our leads, and then go to subject over here, Control V, paste that in. Come back over here, highlight the body, the signature, Control C, come over here, go to the body, Control A, backspace, Control V, paste that in. Let's stretch this out, and let's put in our name at the bottom over here, or pen name. And then we're gonna change this over here where it says, hey, name. We're gonna put in a short code over there because that's saying that in that placeholder, we need to put in this over here, this first name fix. And if we do that, it'll replace this with that person's actual first name. So it makes the email more personable. So we do that. Now there is country over here, but we don't have a short code for country up over here. So what we do instead is, is we say, we're looking for people from your area to apply to this Instagram job. And we have to do it over here as well. So anywhere in the world, but especially people from your area. Okay. 
So now all we have to do is put in our affiliate links. We're gonna highlight this, come back over, where is it? Over here, we hit promote. And over here, we're gonna enter in a tracking ID. Now, I've always used this tracking ID, so I remain consistent with it, but I like, I would say this is, this is better to put in like SP over here for social paid. So you know which product is coming from as well as uh, the account. But anyways, I'm gonna stay consistent and do this and hit generate hop links and copy this hop link by pressing this button. Come back over here and then click on this link button over here to paste this in. So let me just click over here and paste this in. Click OK. And by the way, I've told you that uh, you should be using a different landing page. So for the more advanced users, you can do that. And the way that you'd find that advanced, uh, you know, that extra, that landing page that converts better is by going over here to the bottom and you would use this link over here, right? So you can see the email that I used right over here and you can see how I structured my affiliate affiliate link here. I put in my nickname over here, right? And I put in at the end of this link and TID for uh, tracking ID equals MLGS1. <clears throat> so this is the link I used. But anyways, I'll keep it simple for you guys. And by the way, this is the subject line that I used right over here. And I like to rewrite my subject lines to get better open rates. And I go over how to write good subject lines in my tips and tricks playlist in the description. So check that out if you haven't already. Anyways, so that is that. Now what you're going to have to do is just double check. Everything looks good and hit perfect timing because this sends it out when the lead is most likely to see their email and click on it because MLGS keeps track of historical data and it knows when the leads open their emails. So click that, it'll increase your open rate. Then you're gonna click on a button over here that's gonna say send email. Now I've already sent my email, so I gotta wait 23 hours before I can send another one. So what you're gonna do here is you're gonna click that send button and then when this pops up, you're gonna go and duplicate the same process for your, your other account. So you're gonna go over here, right click, go to duplicate tab, and on this duplicated tab, we're gonna sign out and sign back in with our second MLGS account. So let me just do that real quick. Okay, so we're gonna sign back in. Now, on the second account, we go to the mailing system, select the leads, and then we come back a tab and we copy this subject line over here, Control C. And actually, we should be using the other subject line that I showed you. So let me just go over here and copy this one. And then I'm gonna paste that in over here and then I'm gonna grab the body over here. Click in this box, press Control A, Control C, and then come over here, click in this box, Control A, backspace, Control B. Change this link, click on the link, click on this button, change the one to a two. So we're tracking for our second account. And then everything looks good, we hit perfect timing, and we hit send email, and we do the same process for each one of our accounts. So that'll take you about 10 minutes, even five minutes once you get fast enough. And uh, when, you, when you first start off, it's gonna take you a while because you're not sure, are you doing it right? But eventually you get it down where it's automatic. So if you wanna come on board, do let me know in the YouTube comments or send me an email at mikeiserconsulting at gmail.com. And if you're brand new here and you haven't subscribed already, do subscribe, hit the like button. And also for those of you who haven't had a look at this high ticket series, you could have a look at this over here, but start over from day zero, okay? When you're gonna watch this all. So that covers everything. Hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in tomorrow's video.